Good morning, happy peoples. I am here at my local Walmart, and I'm gonna take you inside and let you guys see how much it costs for us Alaskans here to buy our groceries at our local Walmart. Being as I live in North Pole, you some of you have seen my haul from Safeway. That is the only grocery store that we actually have in the North Pole. This Walmart is about 12 miles or so away, and so it takes about 15, 20 minutes to get here. But this is definitely, I feel, a cheaper alternative to Safeway. Um, and we actually do quite a bit of our grocery shopping here and also our local Fred Meyer. So I'm gonna take you on inside. You can scope it out. We are a family of five. Um, so this is a pretty accurate representation of maybe what we would go through. These groceries will probably last us maybe two and a half, three weeks, I would say, for some of the items. Other items, um, they are definitely more of a stock pantry item. And let me fill you in a little bit. You probably won't see a whole lot of canned food goods and um, pantry type items because I already have a food storage that is set up in my home that I just rotate through. So things like canned vegetables, um, a lot of our condiments, like our bulk sugars and flours and things like that, all of that is already in my food storage. That's just kind of like a rotational pantry. So in case you're wondering, why isn't she buying no canned foods? Cause they're pretty cheap and inexpensive and they last a really long time. Um, I just purchased them in bulk and um, I did that when we had our Sam's Club because as you guys know, if you've watched my previous video, we do not have a big bulk store here anymore. Praise the Lord, a Costco is coming and it is slated to be, I think, by the end of November. So that is super, super exciting. So let's head on inside. I'll show you around. Give me some of your feedback, what you guys, what you guys think about how much it costs and whatnot. All right, let's head on inside. get your groceries, your clothes, your toys, prescriptions, your makeup, and your guns all here at the local Walmart. <laughs>
out to see what I purchased. It's kind of like, oh, uh, it's just it's pretty cool. Hey, so are you guys ready for the grand total of what I spent at Walmart? There is no sales tax in Fairbanks. So there's none whatsoever. Remember there was a 5% sales tax in North Pole and it was capped at that $10 mark. There is no sales tax tax in Fairbanks. The grand total for all of these groceries, which I think if you go and look back at my previous video, the one I did in North Pole, I'll link it right here. I think I got quite a substantial amount more. I'm pretty sure. I need to verify that, but I am pretty sure. Like I said, this is my second time doing this. The grand total, drum roll please. $343.38. Mind you guys, I know that I can make a lot of this stuff from scratch at home. Right now, if you watch our vlogs, we are in the, in the middle of one of the busiest times that we have really ever been in our lives with trying to finish building our home and um, getting into it before winter time. So we have a very limited time allotted. So I do understand that some of these items are convenience foods, they are prepackaged, but right now in my life, that's what we're going with. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed coming with me to Walmart in Fairbanks. I hope this kind of like was an insight for you and let you kind of see what is available to the community. Um, there is only one Walmart in our area. The next Walmart is 365 miles away, which used to be the only Walmart for a long time, which was in Anchorage. And people would legitimately drive from Fairbanks to Anchorage just to go to Walmart. So it was a huge blessing when we actually were able to get a Walmart in our town because they didn't have to drive 365 miles. <laughs> yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not subscribed. Hit that notification bell. Let me know down in the comments below if there was something else that you would like to see in my area. Let me know if there was anything that really surprised you guys as far as the amount of money that was spent on it. Thank you guys so much for watching and we will see you in the next video. Bye. Time to go start dinner.